Dear friends, today I am going to tell you a delicious story, which everyone, young and old, will be happy to hear. So, dear friends, in a quaint village nestled between rolling hills lived a man named Oliver. Timid and unassuming, he shied away from attention. He spent his days working in his small garden, tending to the vibrant array of flowers that brought color to his otherwise quiet life. One day, a group of villagers visited Oliver's garden. Their laughter echoed as they marveled at his blooms. Among them was Lily, a kind-hearted woman who saw past its shyness. She struck up a conversation, and despite his hesitations, a friendship began to bloom. Lily encouraged Oliver to attend the village fair. It was a challenge he'd been avoiding for years. With her by his side, he found himself exploring stalls and chatting with neighbors. Though nerves fluttered, he felt a glimmer of courage. Oliver's garden became a popular spot, thanks to Lily's enthusiasm. Together, they organized gardening workshops, slowly pulling him out of his shell. As he shared his knowledge, he found his confidence growing like the plants he so dearly cared for. One evening, by the fireside, Oliver shared his past with Lily. Childhood memories of being teased had left deep scars. Lily's support provided solace, and he realized he was not alone in his struggles. Lily convinced Oliver to join a public speaking club. Though the thought terrified him, he wanted to conquer his fear. Stammering through his first speech, he discovered the challenge was not insurmountable. Lily's warm presence had awakened a dormant feeling in Oliver's heart. He grappled with his emotions, torn between his love for gardening and his newfound affection for Lily. Misunderstanding strained Oliver and Lily's relationship. Insecurity and fear threatened to drown what they built. It took vulnerability and open communication to weather the storm and emerge stronger. Oliver received an opportunity to showcase his garden at a regional exhibition. The prospect both thrilled and terrified him. Lily's unwavering belief in him pushed him to take the leap. With Lily's encouragement, Oliver's garden wowed the visitors at the exhibition. Through his blossoms, he expressed his journey from timid recluse to a man of courage. As the exhibition concluded, Oliver realized his feelings for Lily ran deeper than friendship. With a bouquet of his most exquisite flowers, he confessed his love. Lily's smile revealed she felt the same. Oliver's garden gained recognition, leading to an offer from a renowned botanical institute. Lily encouraged him to seize the opportunity, assuring their love could withstand the distance. Separated by miles but bound by love, Oliver immersed himself in his botanical studies. Lily's letters were his lifeline, and he poured his heart into the letters he sent back. In the Institute, Oliver faced formidable challenges. With Lily's unwavering support, he tackled his studies and research, emerging as a respected botanist. Amidst his success, Oliver encountered an attractive colleague named Amelia. Their shared passion ignited a friendship that gave rise to jealousy in Lily's heart. 
Lily's jealousy led to confrontations and heartache. Through tears and honest conversations, Oliver and Lily confronted their insecurities, learning to communicate openly. After years of separation, Oliver returned to the village. In his beloved garden, he proposed to Lily, promising a life filled with blossoms and love. Their wedding was a celebration of love and growth. Oliver's garden, once a symbol of his timid nature, now stood as a testament to the beauty that could emerge from overcoming fears. As years passed, Oliver and Lily welcomed twins into their lives. Parenthood brought fresh challenges, but their shared journey only deepened their bond. Tragedy struck as Lily fell ill. Oliver's heart ached as he tended to her, watching the woman who had brought him out of his shell fade away. Lily's passing left Oliver shattered. With his children as his anchor, he found the strength to carry on, nurturing both his garden and his memories. Oliver's children inherited their parents' resilience and kindness. They helped tend the garden, infusing it with new life and purpose. In his later years, Oliver rediscovered his love for public speaking. He shared his story, inspiring others to overcome their fears and embrace their passions. Oliver's time came, surrounded by family and friends. As he closed his eyes for the last time, he knew he had lived a life rich in love, growth, and meaningful connections. Oliver's legacy lived on. His garden remained a place of beauty and inspiration, visited by those who sought solace and courage. The tale of the timid man who blossomed into a remarkable soul became a story whispered among the flowers, a testament to the power of love and resilience. So, dear friends, be sure to give your feedback on how you like this story. And like, share, and subscribe this video. Now I want permission from all of you friends. I will be back again with next new story. Goodbye.